Hey, what's up? So, this is the head guy that runs this YouTube channel called Orny, and um, I want to present you with a project I've been working on. Um, it's called, well, I guess it doesn't really have a name yet. It's, it's not a game. I'm not planning to do it as a game because it takes too much of my time. I mean, I could if I really, I guess, wanted to, but that's not my main goal for this. I just wanted to show you guys um, a kit I've been working on. I guess I'm probably going to make this a kit. It's basically a stealth game kit um, in which um, you're going to see, I guess, the features. So basically, as you can see, the character is jumping around right now. Um, he and I'm going to, you can pick up objects like I'm picking up the box right now. And uh, you can, I guess, place them down, jump on them and activate these things that are called generators, which turn all the lights on and um, all of the automatic doors on so you can walk through doors you might have noticed the game does lag a little bit and uh, another bug right now uh, the objects do go through walls and I'm gonna have to fix that so the game is laggy there are um, a ton of bugs I guess um, not the game the kit I should say this is just the first state of it which I thought would be okay to release um, and um, I guess I, I'm probably going to release it for free so you guys can um, screw around with it, maybe make a game. Uh, the graphics look pretty nice, um, the image effects are good, um, but uh, you can you can use all of this I guess. But um, the textures, the most of the textures and graphics are from various like Google images, various sites, so I'm not sure about the copyright on them. So I suggest you make your own models and characters. This is just a test setup scene demo. Um, you can... Uh, play and um, I guess see all the features you can also stack objects um, I mean it, it's basically done with the rigid bodies in unity so they're not they don't really have a stacking script on them you just stack them using physics also there are po there are potions so um, I guess all the potions have the same model and texture but basically one of the potion uh, allows you to jump really high and uh, it um, makes your gravity gravity a bit weird um, it lowers the gravity, I think, or increases it. I'm not sure. I really can't remember right now, but basically lets you float. Also, smaller objects, you can pick them up and throw them. All of these have sounds on them. The I haven't found all the sounds, so I'm basically using the same, I guess, footstep, drop, stops, jump sound. And uh, you can also change them uh, to ones that you want. Also, um... Uh, I guess another script thing that's gonna appear as he yeah, had the objects uh, go through the walls, which is kind of annoying. Another thing you can do is um, the, as you can see, the sound right now. So these cameras, these CCTV cameras, actually detect if the character is in the range um, that you give, and if you're in the range, a little like eye icon appears. Also, you can destroy the camera by chucking objects at it. Now the game is pretty laggy because I I'm, I haven't optimized it really good. Um, the, you can also pick up I guess or random objects, throw them th and throw them. I already said that. Whatever. Um, the TVs have the render texture that's on the cameras, so basically what the camera sees is up, is appearing on the TV. And um, yeah, so I guess uh, that's pretty much it. I'll, I'll think about making tutorials for you guys once I finish this, um, once I finish the kit. This is basically a really version of the, a uh, really early version of the alpha with tons of bugs. I don't know if I'm going to release it yet or wait a couple of versions more until I release it, until I fixed it. The cameras also have health on them, so not every object is going to do the same amount of damage. So basically the rock deals, for example, 3 damage. And the axe deals five. So the ca if the camera has uh, like six HP, um, you're gonna need to hit it with the rock twice before it gets destroyed. While you, or the five HP, if the camera has five HP, the axe is one hit, while the rock is two hit. So this is the second potion, which allows, which um, disables the camera activity. It doesn't really have any particle effects to it, um, which I would like to add. For example, a spark of electricity goes among the whole map and um, you know what you activated also there are teleporters in the game another potion which it lets you jump 
And um, yeah, you jump in this hole and uh, the level, the scene is uh, done. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, video, uh, this preview of the kit. I will think about, um, I guess, releasing it. Maybe not yet because there's still a lot of bugs. I guess I could give it to you guys, so maybe if you know how to script, you can access my code. I guess uh, maybe fix some things, optimize some things, whatever you want, and uh, make it better. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this, and uh, I'll see you in another video. Bye. <laughs>